Often when I'm talking to my nieces or mentees and they say, how Lulu or how Jerry do you differentiate what's going on in your real world, your personal life to what's going on in your work life. And so, so advice tip number one, if you live at your A game, Every now and again, if you drop to a B or a C, it's not as noticeable because people expect you to always be at an A. So 90% of my time, I'm going to run at an A. So if I have a tough personal situation, I lose a husband, lost a baby, lost a mother, whatever that is, that de completely depletes my emotional tank and sometimes my physical tank. Maybe as we're getting older, you're caretaking for a parent. If you run at such a level of excellence, you have the ability to drop down because you'll bounce back up. The other piece is, is you really have to understand when, when things are going on in your personal life, things are going on in everybody's personal life. You're not special because you, know, you had a, a miscarriage. And, and maybe that sounds cruel, but there's 100,000 women who've had a miscarriage or, or whatever they've had or they're dealing with whatever issues. And so why do we think because crisis has happened in our life that we're the only one who's had crisis happen in their life and there is a, a lowering of expectation. Now, it will take you time to rebuild. It is during those times where, you know, whether it's you know reading your Proverbs or doing your yoga or riding your bike or dancing or painting or whatever it is that you wanna do, it's those times where you need to increase that part of your self-development to help balance those things that you have to take care of in your real work life.